draw a kind of trapezoid shape kind of thing and then curve up and curve up and come down to the slight angle and curve that around and curve that around and then two little curves there and right on the corner part here bring a curve down there and a curve down there and then we'll kind of join those up like that maybe maybe that could be slightly less now what you need to do here is to draw a curve that comes around like that and here a curve that comes around like that now let's ink this in come around here and make that slightly wobbly on the top come around and then just come in like that it looks a bit like a tooth really and you can put some shading in just kind of like that little marks and then come all the way around up to this corner bit and then just hook it in slightly and bring it down there all the way around and then just kind of hook it around the corner a bit maybe bring it out a little bit and then from right down here follow this line around here and just let it flick around the corner Come down here and flick around the corner. And then <laughs> again, you have to kind of bring this up around here and just flick it round. That will come up around there and flick. And then you want to keep flicking some shading in there like that. And you can maybe put some more shading in like that. You want this to kind of squeeze into the bow so do these little kind of marks like that put some shading up along that line up there and also you can maybe put a bit of shading in those kind of hollows then bring these nicely down like that you can put some Kind of marks flicking out like that and then probably a bit of shading in there as well erase the pencil lines when you know it's dry and to put it on the table i'm going to put some shading like this and under there and you're going to want some around there like that and that will stop about there and you might see a bit and then all you need to do is colour it in and if it's going to be a Christmas bow you probably want a nice red and I'm using Copic markers here and you get this nice brush effect so you can flick those colours in like that you can flick up and then that will leave you a kind of highlight colour in the top there and leave a little bit of white in the middle of it and here flick this all the way down and flick back up to it and that will give you that kind of shiny ribbon look if you've got a, a darker red you can always sort of add an extra bit and color in those areas underneath that'll just kind of bring it to life a little bit like that and you can always put in that bit of shading with a gray pen as well there you go, how to draw a Christmas bow or a birthday present or something for putting your hair. <laughs>